quick one for these ray pack cool heaters. This is on and the O is off. And the N is on. Alright. Just a simple way, which way is off for the ray pack heater? The O is off and the little dash is on line. So good thing to know and be aware of when working on these, especially if you have one that this one the screen blanked out, so got in the off position. All right. I suppose it does make sense on these that it wouldn't be super clear which way is on or off in that you don't want just anyone messing with your pool or spa heater. But O is off and the line is on. I, I was troubleshooting one that the screen was blanked out and uh, was uh, throwing the fuse and it threw me for a little bit uh, figuring out which way was on or off or just be knowing for sure that there was no power passing through there. So I had to go to another one and prove it that O is off and the line is on just to you know be for sure as I was working on it. Hope to be bringing in a couple videos for you. One just kind of cut into the chase what was actually wrong when uh, the board was shorting out and sh blowing fuses or blowing the, the board fuse and then another one going a little bit into maybe uh, thinking out loud uh, what the experience was for me and how I figured things out a little bit more or going a little bit, little bit deeper on troubleshooting um, just kind of the mental process of, of trying to figure things out um, and that those might be a little bit more time consuming, so it might take me a little longer to get to, but I wanted to put this video here nice and fast, how you can tell if your Raypack pool or spa heater was switched on or off. So O is off and the line is on. You gotta be ready for the Lord's return. The Lord is gonna come for his bride anytime. Uh, Jesus came to seek and to save those that were lost. That was me. We've all missed the mark. Every person sinned and come short of the glory of God. But Jesus took the punishment that we rightfully deserve on himself at the cross, and he gives his righteousness to those that believe on him. So if you haven't put your trust in him, call out to him to save you. It's a gift of salvation. You can't earn it. He did it all on the cross, and he calls us to a loving relationship with him. So you are invited to be reconciled to God, something that was impossible. God is holy and our sin is separated, but without God, it was impossible. But God came to save us. He sent his son, Jesus. You know, again, he took all of our sin on the cross and uh, gave himself so that we could be justified in him. So call out to him, get into the Bible, into the word and start to grow so that you're protected from deception. There's strong delusions out there, strong deception. And Jesus is the way, the truth and the life. He's the only way to the Father. He's the only way to God. So don't don't get tripped up or tricked and don't, don't miss out on what is yours through Jesus. You know, call out to him today. Don't wait. Time is short. He's going to return for his people. And uh, if you missed it, and you find yourself in the tribulation, call out to Jesus to save you. Uh, you'll likely die for your faith, but still, like, you have eternal life. The tribulation only lasts seven years, so if you find yourself in part of it, you know, it's not going to be long before everything's finished anyway. Seven years is not a long time, although in the tribulation it's going to seem like a long time. But be faithful unto death. That means trusting in Jesus all the way. Um, there's probably not going to be a lot of food um, and it's going to be a difficult situation. But uh, you, can, you can still have eternal life through Jesus because, again, he took all of our sin on himself at the cross. So put your trust in him today so you don't miss out and uh, so that you have the covering is he is the lamb, the lamb of God that takes away the sin of the world. All right, stay safe out there. God bless. God bless you.